hope everybody's doing out all right out there. Uh, best regards to you and yours. I know this thing sucks being quarantined and not being able to go to work and school and all these different things and risk of getting sick and people are sick. But uh, if you're doing all right, good for you. Uh, I hope everybody's doing all right. Try to have some fun if you can. You know, being stuck in the house can get real boring. Um, so uh, go ahead and eat and get fat and then go on a diet once everything goes back to normal. That's all. Calamari solo mission, anti-social squid distancing. I just went down to the local seafood market. They had the calamari rings already prepped and cleaned. Easy, get those, batter them, fry them up, get your tartar sauce, get your lemon, get your uh, um, marinara, whatever you like, cocktail sauce, and good to go. This shit right here is essential. And here's a key, here's a key, the key to the process. You notice, I don't even let my squid rings touch, not until they've been sterilized in hot grease. Like I said, I'm just keeping it simple. Got the Louisiana chicken fried for batter. Some basic sauces. You know, I put the calamari rings in the water, drip them off, bread them, put them on the pan, slap them in the, in the oil. I gotta take those out. Ain't nothing fancy going on here. Just making some calamari for lunch. Good. Eat that one. Now, I cook all the time, but I almost never make cooking videos because it's a lot of work to try and cook and make a video at the same time. But this is some real easy basic stuff that pretty much anybody can do. You don't really have to be very knowledgeable of cooking. It's just basic steps. You know, go get your squid. Heat up some grease to about 275 degrees, but um, and get you some batter. When you th when you cook your first one though, just throw one in there and see what it's like. Cause if um, you cook it and you don't like the way it comes out, then you can adjust the amount of time you cook it or uh, the temperature. It just depends on um, uh, you know every stove is a little different. So I'm not gonna tell you a, a, a temperature range like go high on the on the burner or whatever. I'm going about medium high on mine, um, and that seems to be working, but. Every stove's a little different. I think the temperature range is somewhere around 275, 300 and cook for a minute to minute and a half. Um, pull it out and then throw it in the colander or throw it on a, uh, on, a, on a screen rack or something. I don't usually put it on a plate with uh, paper towels because then it sits there and the oil it soaks up and it gets a little more soggy. These are nice and crispy right here and they're very good. Crispy. Mm. And then you dip them um, with your favorite sauce, put a little lemon squeeze on there, whatever. Like I said, no sides today. I'm doing um, social distancing, so I get to eat this all to myself. So that's one of the benefits of quarantine. And that's a wrap on this anti-social, social distancing calamari solo mission. That's social distancing done delicious, baby. You get, get out there and try it. But make sure you don't let your squid rings touch. Sterilize them in that grease. Y'all stay fishy. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs>